understanding ghostly scribe a deep dive into unique english phrases hello everyone welcome to our english language learning channel today we're going to explore a fascinating phrase ghostly scribe this term is not just about ghosts or writing but it's a blend of history literature and imagination Let's unravel the meaning together and see how it can enrich your English vocabulary. Ghostly scribe is a phrase that combines two distinct words, ghostly, meaning related to ghosts, and scribe, which refers to a person who writes. However, when these words come together, they create a vivid and somewhat mysterious image. It often evokes the idea of an invisible or supernatural writer, perhaps one who pens stories or messages from beyond. This phrase can be used literally in stories or myths, or metaphorically in situations where writing seems to have an unknown or mysterious origin. The concept of a ghostly scribe can be traced back to ancient and medieval times. In history, There are tales of spirits or unseen forces that influenced writers or dictated sacred texts. In literature, this idea is often used to create a sense of mystery or supernatural influence. Famous works like Shakespeare's plays sometimes hint at the idea of a ghostly presence guiding the pen of the writer. In modern times, ghostly scribe can take on new meanings. It's sometimes used to describe an anonymous writer or someone who writes in the background, unrecognized. In the digital age, it could even refer to AI-generated content or messages that seem to appear without a clear human author. The term captures the essence of mystery and creativity that is still relevant in our times. Ghostly scribe is more than just a phrase. It's a window into a world of mystery, history, and creativity. Whether you're reading a classic novel or encountering the term in modern contexts, understanding this phrase enriches your comprehension and appreciation of the English language. Thank you for joining us today, and we hope this video has been enlightening. Keep exploring and happy learning.